Howdy, everyone. Larry Bailey here, Mortgage Workflow Partners. Listen, I um, had a uh, we're we're helping a client launch their HELOC product. Um, it's a credit union, and it's it's a very common problem where you're stuck with not knowing how to get this balloon checkbox to check. And what we're talking about is, of course, in the loan file. Um, we're specifically talking about field 1659. So if we look at uh, over here. Um, specifically, we're talking about this guy right here. And there it, are tons of comments going back to 2016, maybe, on the user form. Um, anyway, when I come across problems like this, uh, the first thing I do is research to make sure, because that is a Cal field. And effectively, Encompass wants you to have a loan term um, that is longer than when it's due, i.e. a balloon, like 180 due, uh, sorry, 360 due and 180, that kind of thing. But when in this particular HELOC, this uh, credit union client is like, listen, it's a tw it's a 10 year interest only HELOC, and at the end of that 10 years, if you have a balance, pay it off. That's a balloon. Or if you want to renew it, we'll, we'll renew it for you under a new 10 year term. So basically, all you really need to do um, is when you when you come over. Um, in our dev form, we do this quite often. We'll put the field here first to see how it behaves. So basically, um, we've created the field here. Um, it's field 1659. You can see it kind of flashing here. If we, if we hold a control button down and click it, 1659. Um, when that's checked and we go back into the URLA lender, voila, it's checked. <laughs> so with all the other uh, back and forths that have gone through, hopefully this is uh, helpful for you. It's one of the, the things that I always do is, is look for the, um, the cleanest, most obvious answer first, which is use Input Form Builder and put the field there. This doesn't always work. Sometimes Encompass will not let you do this kind of a thing, but in this particular case, I rule it out first. And I want to pass along this information because I'm not kidding. I found um, no answers uh, anywhere to tell me exactly how to get this checkbox to be checked other than to do the thing that is not aligned with what the client needs. So I wanted to stick this out there as a message to everyone and hopefully it helps. Take care everybody, anything we can ever do, please let us know.